Hi folks, my name is Stan Werben. I'm the owner of Elderly Instruments. We've been here for 47 years now. This is my daughter Lillian. She's been here, well, for her whole life, pretty much. <laughs> Officially five years. Right. So we're here to talk about uh, really the, the beginnings mostly of Elderly Instruments and a little bit of other stuff too. Um, so it all started in 1972. Uh, Sharon McInturf and I uh, had graduated college, we were searching for old, fretted, and stringed instruments. And this was around the time when brand new instruments were just not considered to be as good as the old vintage ones. They'd managed to acquire nine or ten really good old instruments, but uh, quickly ran out of people or friends to sell or trade to. And right then uh, we were thinking about opening up a music store and we counted around 10 music stores in Ann Arbor, Michigan where we were. And um, in early 72, we met the owner of Curious Bookshop in East Lansing, Michigan. Uh, his name is Ray Walsh. He's still there, it's a fine shop. And he clued us into a small and available space in East Lansing where we could open up a music store. And they moved within a few months. <laughs> So we spent the 4th of July hanging up posters all around East Lansing, informing the public of our grand opening just the next day. So on July 5th, 1972, we opened, and we sold a thumb pick. The next day, we sold a capo. From then on, we got busier and we never looked back. Uh, the original space of 10 by 12 feet quickly filled with more instruments, more music, and more people looking for instruments to take home. We moved from East Lansing to Old Town Lansing, just down the road, three miles down the road, in 1983, where we still are. My wife Sandy left a lengthy career in the government to join Elderly Instruments in 1990, and our daughter Lillian has been alongside us in recent years, helping us move into the 21st century. <laughs> So now, this July 5th, we celebrate 47 years, um, and we are honored to still be able to open our showroom to our customers and give them the elderly living room experience. <laughs> so that's the abbreviated story of Elderly Instruments, and a bit of where we're going. We hope you'll make it to visit our showroom, but if you're too far away, we hope to see you on our website. Either way, we urge you to make yourselves at home. Thank, Thank you, you for 47, 47 years, years, and here's, here's to 47, 47 more. more.